Hi guys, I consider DI section to be the orphan section because we spend the least time we have for the preparation on DI logic. Like maximum time we spend in quant, then somewhere for logic, uh, verbal, and then least for the DI. And when it comes to DI, we think of calculations, line chart, bar chart, all those graphs. And from logic point of view, think of co-encoding, digestion sense, blood relationship. Jabki CAT may you are not going to get any of these things. So welcome to the DI section of the CAT paper. CAT have evolved not today over the last 10 years since 2008 they have changed the pattern into more of a logic based di yeah you will find di but it's basically logic question you will find logic but this is basically di it's fine this is all gonna be messed up so if we ask any of your friends who have given the cat exam last year di logic section is one of the areas you have to focus on okay so there are eight sets four questions each Historically, four from DI, ideally four from DI, four from the logic section, but there is no fixed pattern. You will expect all different kind of question coming in the DI section, logic section. So, if you have any book, any means any book, any coaching class book you have, it's not enough to prepare you. Fine. But what I've done is over the years, I've tried to try to find out a way in which we can define them. For example, there will be one definite set on fill the blanks. So, fill the blanks is basically they remove a couple of data. They which you have to identify and then solve the question. So fill the blanks DI number one. Number two is a case slate. So case slate is basically a, it look like a puzzle. But when you start solving it's basically DI. So you have to solve DI but given to you the text. Third is a quant based DI. That the typical one set four question on that coming in the CAD paper for last three years. It can be based on like last year CAD paper it was based on PNC. So it was a PNC based DI. Yeah, it's basically quant question converted into a DI question. So you have to practice all those things. So if you're a CET King student or if you want to buy our CET King books, CET King green books we have updated as per this new paper pattern. For example, all the uh, logic based DI, everything is covered there. So these three sets is something you have to focus on. And trust me, if you do these three set, you're covering up the cutoffs, you will definitely cross 90 percentile. Three set attempt is around 90 percentile, obviously provided how many questions to write. Fine. So after this comes the logic based DI. Logic based DI is basically they give you bar chart, but it's a logic question. They'll give you line chart, but it is based on logic. Okay. So for example, if you're joining CET King mock series, you understand all this type of question when they start coming. So you'll understand. I'll give you an example of each of them as we go along. So please do subscribe to the channel here so you can get all the updates automatically for all the uh, uh, updates about CAT, CET, other exams. Yep. So, five sets. Okay. Last three sets is something new, which nobody have any idea. They can give a chess ka question. They can give a Sudoku question. We can expect anything and everything on this earth to come in this section. So, five sets. I can predict what kind of question will be there. Three sets. Nobody have any idea what is going to come. So, we have updated all these five type of sets in CET in books. So, in case you want to buy, you can join us for the program or for the classroom program, online program, whichever way you want to join us. Okay. Now come to the uh, how much attempt part. I've been taking interviews of students. So I've taken two interviews of people with 99.5 percentile plus in DI logic section alone. So if you talk to them, so they've told me that one of them did four sets, all correct. 16 plus 16 correct because the raw, raw score he could feel that yeah, all of them are correct. So he got 99.55 percentile. Another guy who did five sets, and out of them, he said maybe a couple of questions might be wrong and he got 99.65 percentile. So on the basis of these people, your attempt have to be five sets. Five set kardo so that I can, I assume some of the questions might go wrong. You will touch 99 percentile. So 99 percentile, five sets, 95 percentile, four sets and 90 percentile, three sets. That's a motor motor thumb rule. As we go along in next coming V videos, I'll give you the exact breakup of that number. Yeah, but as of now, I'm just the overview. So DI logic is your area to focus on. Try all different type of questions which are coming. So syllabus wise, that's the that's the syllabus for the DI logic point of view. Take it. 32 question and you should focus on that. All right. All the best. Thank you.